Shot clock dwindling. Ball matched up on Adebayo. Gives it up over to the corner. Noel's got to put up the shot and knocks it down to open up this game from down. I've been waiting for that, and that's not a problem for me. And, and certainly, uh, really big getting the thunder on the board. And Noel, the beneficiary on the beautiful pass. Activity, I tell you, and CP3 can just be so deceiving with the basketball. And Noel got blocked by Noel, who is everywhere in the early moments of this one. Both on the offensive and defensive end. So he's feeling good after missing the last six games with that ankle sprain that he suffered against Cleveland. Now the left hand. And he flicks it up and in. It certainly helped him here in his first game back. And Nerland's Noel has just been outstanding for the Thunder this season. And sometimes you don't really realize how much you miss somebody. Peters as none comes off again, but you'll take that. Kendrick Nunn, a left-hander, terrific win, shooter. Win against the grain as Paul fires up the three. Despite eight points. Uh, and he, he gets, what, uh, over 11 a game in that painted area out of Bayou. And Paul, nice gliding, floating shot. And so he has had a productive first half now with 12 points. Out of Bayou, the 22-year-old, was mid-round, or I should say mid-first round. Horse Robinson off the three-point line, out of bio inside. Good defense that time. Stood up by Muscala in the Thunder. With the shot clock off at five seconds. Paul, open three. Well, Thunder open up quarter number three. There is Scott Minari, thought about the three. Paul will take it himself. As here, much taller defensive player on him. Pulls it back out. Ball movement sets up Gallo, and the marksmanship continues. Now, he didn't get a, a shot block, but boy, I tell you, he changed a couple of them by Adebayo. That's, that's your, just as effective. That's your favorite uncounted stat, right, Mike? Absolutely. Looks like numbers is Leonard. You could hear the slap on the arm. Almost a turnover. Paul drives, floats, and got the nice hop. Thunder will take any offense that it can get here. Tough step back there by none, no good. Paul got to the mid-range, pulls up, and a money shot for Chris. Taking 29 three-pointers tonight, just one mid-range shot. The mid-range has been OKC's specialty, but Miami's defense is designed, really, to take those shots away and, and give none off the mark from three. And Muscala was out in the corner. Paul's going to get fouled in transition. Just the second team foul on my kind of shot of momentum. Well, they got all three-point shooters out there with the exception of out of Bayou. He's more of a passive facilitator. As Grodzik will get called for the foul. Well, that was something discussed coming in. Both teams getting the free throw line at an effective rate on the season. Right now it's favoring Miami. There's Gallo again. And he's got another one from he, he never loses it. He, he, he either loses it or he doesn't. That was just beautiful. He went through this leg the opposite way. And still was able to find a shooter. Could not get that. There's Diallo. Almost had the steal. Paul finally comes up with a loose ball. Sends it up the floor. And Diallo with a nice reverse touch. Noel snatches away that rebound off the Robinson miss. That's how you want to lose. Just get, some good stuff. get a stop and then get something off of that stop. So you, you get a stop, you get a foul. So Miami now on a 7-0 run. Paul trying to slow it down. Off the mark, Burton. Looks at the line for the three-point play. So that's six quick ones. Microwaved by the Thunder offense. Paul nearly had a steal on Johnson. And then coming back around. This is that push shot. Ball got around the screen, getting in the mid-range, and scores with 17-3. That is a tough sequence for Oklahoma City. Ball fakes the pass, takes the three, and knocks it down. Big. See if the Thunder can get a stop here. See a whole lot of pressure. Dragic off on the mid-range. Ball pushes. 
No look pass outside to shoot it for the three. Halfway. Critical possession. This time is not on the Thunder's side. Ball inbounded into Adebayo. And they're going to get a foul as Butler got held up. 